Tastes a little funky town. Ooh, that's a hot mug, guy. Hey guys, this is my review for Supernatural Season 2, Episode 10, Hunted. This episode has Gordon Walker return once again, hunting Sam, specifically going after him and other yellow-eyed demon chosen children, because he's found out now about the kind of the prophecy that's going on. We see him kill a guy at the very beginning of the episode who can apparently electrocute people, and he goes specifically for him, and it's got White Rabbit playing in the background, which is a pretty good, awesome scene. The Doctor, though, I swear the Doctor has been used in this show before, but I can't remember what. Either way, the episode's actually still pretty good because we see Sam get to hang out with another yellow-eyed demon chosen child. This one being Ava, who is the girl from Ginger Snaps, and she's actually kind of a pretty comedic character in this episode, which makes what happens with her later on in the season, the whole ending of this episode too, such a great little plot twist. We see that Gordon and Dean kind of have a more one-on-one -on -one interactions about the morality of their jobs, what is the proper choice, what is the proper decision to make when you're given a situation where you can possibly prevent the end of the world. Overall, the episode I feel is a little slow getting to the kind of the midpoint, but once Dean is kidnapped, we get a lot of great tension. We get a lot of cool little moments, especially when Sam throws his boot to get blown up by the tripwire mines. And then the end of the episode is a great way of putting Walker away because admittedly when I was watching the episode too, it's like, okay, if you don't kill him, what are you gonna do? How are you gonna take care of him? So that little twist at the end is a pretty cool idea. And again, it brings Walker back in the third season in one of the best ways ever. Again, Gordon Walker was such a great character, a great villain character of this series. And Sterling K. Brown is also a fantastic actor too. As a whole, this episode isn't as woo as you would kind of think it is. It does lay down stuff to be wooed by later on, however. So it's a really good stepping stone. It's not an exceptional episode, but that's because we had two exceptional episodes of the previous reviewed. This one is just a very good episode. So in the end, I'm gonna give Hunted a five out of seven. Now I asked you guys about giving me your comments about this episode, so I'm gonna read some off right now. Hunted is so interesting. We get to meet Ava, a fellow psychic kid poisoned by demon blood, who's having visions as well of Sam dying. We see Sam leave Dean and attempt to find out why. And we also get the return of Gordon, who is now a bit, little bit insane. Sterling K. Brown is so good in this role. I love Hunted and it's a frequent rewatch for me. I liked Hunted a lot. Even upon rewatching it, there are some surprises for me. It was unpredictable in a good way. Crotone was tense and heavy, while this one is also quite tense, but left a little bit more room to breathe and hope. That's a cute dog. Thank you. Arrow is cute. Hunted is good for one reason only. Sterling K. Brown, or Gordon. He's back not to hunt the vampires, but hunt psychics, because to him they are monsters and Sam just so happens to be one of these psychics. A good reason to bring him back in the show. Ava is a likable and quirky character who's interesting, but her arc needs to be wrapped up in season 2 part finale. I also would have liked to see a lot more appearances from the psychic kids because there's only hear about other ones, but we don't actually get to see any of them, and apparently there's a lot more of them in the world, but you really can't fault the show for that because of budget, especially in season two. I actually would say that you got enough from it. You saw that there was some people that they met beforehand in the first season. There was some people that they met in the second season. I think they were kind of trying to say that there were more, but when Sam arrives, it kind of makes the appearance that those are the final ones. We do know that Ava has been killing others that get there. I feel that at the very end, it really makes that Ava twist even more surprising when find out that she's been killing people because she just enjoys it so much. Really good dips into that Ginger Snaps character. Anyways, guys, that's all from me. The next episode is Plaything, so make sure to give me your comments about that episode in the comments section down below, and I'll make sure to read off the best ones when I do that review. I'll be reviewing those episodes over the next week, so so when I come back and I start uploading them, you guys will have a bunch of filler to watch before Supernatural Season 15 returns. I can't believe it's a six week hiatus. That's crazy. Anyways, guys, that's all for me. See you guys next time. Thanks for watching the video. My name is Nitz, and you might remember me from the animated cult classic TV show, Undergrads. It's been a while, but I'm happy to say the click is finally getting back together in an all new movie, thanks to a successful Kickstarter campaign. But we are still asking for your support. To see any and all updates about the upcoming Undergrads movie, be sure to check out and like the Bring Back Undergrads Facebook page. And with any luck, we'll see you guys soon.